hope me not even wash my face yet for sure now. Um, I've not even washed my face as yet. I just wake up, not wake up from about five really, and wake up from about five o'clock. Um, first thing I'm addressing is a fake GoFundMe page by Simon McAuliffe. Simon, I'm reporting it to the fraud, fraud squad, ASAP. People, there's only one GoFundMe page, and that page is managed by and organized by my sister, my blood sister, Kaylan's aunt, Angela May Kelly. That is the only GoFundMe page. Do not support any other GoFundMe. If I did not say support the page don't support if it if you don't see me say um i gave permission for any fundraising that means i did not give any permission for any fundraising any fundraising that is being done for kaylan has to be approved by me because i am the one who's going to have to speak to the bank and the police when time the problem comes please don't want anybody trying to reap anything off of Kaylan. Kaylan's journey has just begun. And the bills them is very expensive. People, do not make any fake pages on behalf of me, my family, or Kaylan Dowdy. We are not standing for it. Whatever the little, the little page where we have, whatever we can raise on it, I am grateful and I am thankful for it. Because remember, we don't give anybody anything to put down. It's just an unfortunate circumstances which all we have and the bills are overwhelming. Kaylan's recovery will cost a lot. Kaylan is still in a coma. Kaylan is still unconscious. Kaylan is still on life support. Her BP is still dropping, still not maintaining her BP on her own. Right? I don't want, right now, where I have to be, fight, the doctors are fighting for her. She has a blood clot in the, in the left arm that they're trying to get under control before it goes to the lungs. You understand? It's a lot. Okay, yesterday when I went to the hospital, she was looking so droopy. I even had to ask them if she was on any sedative. And they said, no, she's not on any sedatives. Please do not make fake pages. This is a life and death situation. My child life hanging in the balance. Me no need nobody to try and ruin it. Right? People on the need to be mindful and be, oh my man, come on man, people, come on man. You want, you're, you're that heartless? You people are that heartless? That's what I'm going to make. I, and pe I see people starting to, to support it because everybody is rallying around and trying to do their best to help Kaylan. And I appreciate it. I'm glad for you know that I'm not alone in other fights here. I'm glad to know that I'm not alone because the mothers have been reaching out. The fathers have been reaching out. The, everybody has been reaching out. Even children have been reaching out. And you people going to make a fake page? Simon McAuliffe, your page is fake. Fake page. I did not give such permission. I not even open my eye this morning when somebody sent it to me. I said, if this is, if this is, is right. I said, no, it's a fake page. Fake fundraiser. Nobody should click on it. Angela May Kelly organizing Kaylan's go fund me tammy faye is doing a fundraiser for kaylan as well on facebook who is associated with auntie donna those are the pages you should be going to if you don't see me on video giving permission then it is not true if you don't see me making any reports and updates it is not true i said this day before yesterday so i'm even sh a shock that people actually went ahead and started donating to that fake page come on people kayla need prayers kayla we need to pray for kayla lungs 
so Kaylan can start breathing on her own. That's what's holding up the MRI right now. Right? We need Kaylan to start breathing. Right? Um, yes, I've been receiving money from Ashanti. I see your messages. I have been receiving money from Ashanti in regards to, but, um, how, no, I don't know how, no, I don't, I see your message. I don't know how transparent it is, but he has been, he has been doing something. Um, well, I can look into the transparency. Yes, I can see the messages. Um, I can look into the transparency of his program, but so far I have no problems with him. He has been turning up. He has been calling. He has been checking up. He, you know, he has, he, he, he has become a friend and I, I don't know. I don't know the credibility, but I will check on it. You know, I can't, I can't call out someone without reason. And I want you all to understand that I'm not a person to judge. I'm not a person. I always give people the benefit of the doubt because I look for the good in people. That's the first thing I do. I look, everybody that comes and reaches out to her, I look for the good in them. They have to prove me wrong. And then I can say, um, then it is so or it is not so. But so far, Ashanti has been a blessing. Um, as for the fake go for me page, I want you all to report it. If you see it as you see it, report it. As soon as you catch sight of it, report it. Only go fund me, only one. And that's why we decided that we don't want another one because we don't want any confusion. It better when we reach our money, we push it up and try to get a little more for her because, you know, the care going to take a lot than to have two or three go fund me pages and confuse the public. And then other fake pages start popping up and we don't know who they belong to, where they're from, where they're going. Right? So that is it.